Team Golo Remy, my Golo Remites, my Golo Remians, what is up? We're going to be doing top 15 flick ups today. Get your notepads out. So, we're going to be taking all kinds of notes. We're going to learn how to do these flick ups. Let's go. All right, guys. So, we're going to be doing 15 flick ups, like I said. We're going to knock out five in this dope location. Then we're going to go somewhere else in Kansas City. You guys can check out our hometown city. All right, guys, so this one is really kind of simple, but it's going to lead into a progression of the next one I want you guys to do. It's good practice to get started out with. So what we're going to do is just drag it back for our back foot. Using the same foot you drag it back with, you're going to pick it up. And you're just juggling. Really, really easy. Very simple. And you're up. So let's bring it in close real quick so you guys can see. You're gonna drag it across your body, but back to your foot next to your plant foot. And drop it back, flick it up, and you start juggling. All right, so for the first one, it's a difficult flick up, really kind of dynamic one that kind of uses an around the world and a back heel flick. It's a little difficult, but if you guys practice it a few times, you'll be able to get it down. So it is a flick up from the back, transitioned into and around the world. So as you can see, it's a little difficult to get down. Let's go ahead and bring it in close real quick so I can show you guys the fundamentals of this flick up. If you start with the ball, whatever foot you like, I'm starting with my right foot because it's my strong foot. You're going to bring it across your body. You're going to stop it with your foot, but as you stop it with your foot, you're going to flick it up. It's the same foot you dragged it back with. And then as it comes up, you're going to go on the outside of the ball to catch it in the round of the world. So real quick, kind of close up here so you can see it. This one is one probably seen me and Will do quite a bit. And it's really nice to do if you have a concrete surface or a hard surface but you can do it on a turf field really well as well. What you're gonna do is gonna have the ball between your feet, start like this, you're gonna hop, and when you're coming out, you're gonna let the ball come off and you're gonna fuck it up like that. Just hit off the ground with, your, with the toe of your foot. All right guys, so this one's a little combo. It's the clap up, flick, utilizing around the world as well. There we go. So really, you're focused on getting enough air underneath the ball so you can get your foot underneath. If you go too quick with one foot, it's gonna go that way or that way. So make sure when you're clapping your feet, you're coming together all at the same time. All right guys, so breaking it down real quick and close. Like I said, you're gonna come through. You're gonna pop the ball up. You can either go inside or outside. I'm gonna go inside. So I think it transitions well. And then catch it like that, all right? All right guys, this one is kind of something that Neymar does in games. If you can get this down while practicing flick ups, you could really actually use this in games. It's really, really cool. It's kind of like the rainbow, but you're using both of your feet. So you're gonna start with the ball between your feet like this, and you're gonna flip the ball up from behind so it lands in front of you. It's a little difficult to do, but you guys can get it down. All right, guys, let's flick up six through 10. Let's break them down real quick. We're at Union Station, beautiful part of Kansas City. Way, way cooler than DC or Croatia or wherever anybody else is living. Kansas City is the number one city in the world. So make sure you come visit, all right? All right so what you're gonna do is you're gonna flick it up. You're gonna catch it in between your knees. Then you're gonna transition that catch in your knees to a single leg hold. And then you can start juggling from there. So what you're gonna do is you get the ball out here. I'm gonna flick it up, catch it, transition like a flamingo, and you stand like that, and you're a badass. No one can get the ball. Most protected way to get the ball, you go from here, you start running, no one can stop you, all right? <laughs> here, 
you start running, no one can stop you, all right? I'm just staying there. Not as clean as the freestylers. All right, so next one, a little simple, but it looks really nice when you get it nice and clean. It's a flick up, so you're gonna approach the ball. You're just gonna scoop up. I've heard it called the sombrero. I've heard it called the B-Millie sometimes. I don't know. Just depends where, you know, what part of the country you live in. Push the ball, flick it up, you start juggling. Bring it in close here. You're gonna come underneath it, scoop it, and then when you start to come up, when the ball starts to pick up, you have to get your foot on the front side of the ball to make it come back up. If you don't curl your toe up when you're doing this, it's just gonna go out in front of you. Your goal is to get it to go above your head. Why it's called the sombrero. So real quick, up close, and scoop up. You're here. Scoop up. All right, so for this one, it's another one of these ones where you transition. Looks really slick, but it's not too hard to do. So the ball's out here, you wanna start juggling. Come up, get the ball between your feet, transition on the outside, and then flick it up like that off the ground. So one more time, full body. Start ball between your feet on the outside, and you start juggling, boom. Gotta go ram it. So up close, breaking this down real quick. Like I said, you're gonna get in between your feet, bring it on the outside, you can bring it low like this. You're gonna bring up the side of your leg and you're gonna tap it down. So at full speed, here we go. All right guys, another quick easy one that you can put into your repertoire. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Do your flick up game on par 100 hashtag balling out. You're gonna go ahead and come up here and start it, bang off your knee, start juggling. I'm gonna break down the rainbow for you guys. We've done it in other videos before, but I think it's important that you practice when you get it down because a lot of different body movements go into it so you can complete it correctly. But the way that I get this down well, as I position my foot a little bit at an angle, this one's straight and this one's at an angle. The ball is on my right ankle and then touching between my Achilles and my ankle on the other one. You're gonna lean forward and when you lean forward, you're gonna drag your foot up a little bit like this. So the ball comes up the back of your foot and then you're gonna easily just flick it up. It should feel really natural. Your body should be moving forward and the ball should flick up. You can make it go far, you can make it go up. Um, you can just play around with it, see what, see what you like the most. But if you want to move forward, obviously, you want to flick it that way. If you want it to stay here, you're going to flick it up and you're going to release it at a different point. So bring it in real quick so you guys can see, just to make sure you get the fundamentals down. Right ankle on the ball, or your left ankle, you know, whatever way you go. This way, I'm going to go this way. Right ankle, your Achilles, your ankle. Right there, you're going to put the ball, right? In the right ankle, and they're going to lean forward onto your left foot or your right foot, whatever one you're using. You're going to flick it up as you move forward, boom. And that's how you do the rainbow, kids. Welcome to Liberty Memorial, guys, as we learn the 11th flick up. This is another easy flick up to add to your collection. Simply pull the ball back to your opposite foot and flick it up in the traditional way, but using your weak foot. This will for sure help you build coordination in that weak foot. This is another one that is super easy to get down, but it looks complex. Simply start with the ball under your foot, flick it up with your toe, and with the opposite foot, smack it back down into the ground.
Once again, you may have seen this one, you can already do it, but comment below if you can, and then start to add it around the world to it. Send us your best attempts on Instagram and Snapchat. Alright guys, last one. You've never seen this one and I call it the B Millie Bull. Flick it up, use that noggin, B Millie bounce it off the ground, you're pure ballin'. guys enjoyed them make sure to like make sure to comment and be sure to subscribe if you haven't if you don't subscribe to us then literally leave be sure to check out all of our other flick up videos make sure you go to www.glorm.com enter your email so you get the newsletters every single friday we got all kinds of great stuff coming up for you guys soon catch you guys later